What's up guys, it's Brown Gravy Hunting here and today I'm gonna show you how to make this awesome this awesome frog hunting dart right here. So first what you wanna do is get a Q tip, a hollow Q tip with some scissors. You wanna cut off any side that looks skinnier, just snip it off. And I'm gonna have to go get that in a minute. You cut that off, you grab a toothpick you grab a toothpick and you're just gonna slide it in there and there you go you got that you got that part done and I'll get back to you in a second alright the next thing you wanna do is grab a sticky note and some tape this is gonna take a little practice don't grab the sticky part first you wanna grab the corner make sure the sticky parts right here on that's where my fingers touching and you wanna kinda make it a cone shape might take a while but you'll get it done as you can see I'm starting it right here and when I'm done making the cone I'll show you all right once you're done making this cone right here you want to grab a piece of tape like I got and you want to wrap it you want to wrap it right here on the thing on the seam part so the tape can touch the part that you wrapped around and it can and the part that you wrapped it around the part you wrapped it around and the part that you wrapped around so I got the tape on there like that that holds it there should be good I'm gonna put a little bit more tape so it'll just be tape and the paper won't be touching the barrel of the blowgun and then you want to grab your little dart thing you made and you want to push it straight down. Straight down in there like that. And then you get your tape. Get another piece of tape. That might be too big. But you want to wrap it so it keeps it keeps uh, your your dart in here like that and you want to make it so no air can get in there and I'll get back to you as soon as I get my blow gun alright I got my blow gun and my dart you want to take this end piece right here just take it off for this this part you just want to take it off and you want to kind of put it just let it sit in the barrel like that then you grab your sharpie and you just write a line where it's touching the end of the barrel just like that all all the way around and I'll get back to you as soon as I'm done with that all right once you get that done you grab your scissors you just want to cut on that line like that and then you grab your blow gun and you put it in your barrel I have tape on the other side so I can't put it in that side and you just blow it to the end if you could hear that and then you can put your nose back on and I'll get to the shooting. Alright, we're shooting this far away. It's about five yards or so. So, trying to kill a frog or something. And we're shooting at that, that cardboard box right there. And I'll set you up. Alright, there you go. Night, night. Night. Love you. Love you too. Alright, we got it here, and just an accuracy test, I'm shooting at that from how far I just showed you. Oh, that was a bad one. That was my fault, sorry guys. Oh, and it broke. So let me get my other one. Lower it down the barrel like I said. Sorry guys, I'm trying to hurry up. Alright, got it. I'm aiming at it, that's where on it. You see? You see that right there? It's right in there. Stuck in pretty good. And I'll show you a safety way you can just shoot in your house for fun. Alright, for indoor, all you gotta do is grab one of these and the end of a Q tip and just slide it on there like that and it's safety. Alright, we're gonna have to make this as fast as possible. It's just one shot, real quick. 